In South Korea, a group of female free divers on Jeju Island fish in the frigid ocean nearly every day. They're called the henyos. NPR's Ari Daniel reports researchers looked into the adaptations that make this possible. When the henyos were asked to dunk their faces in cold water, their heart rates dropped more than non-divers due to a lifetime of training. When it came to the genetics, everyone on the island, henyos and non-henyos, basically had the same genes, including two that stood out. One related to cold tolerance and one related to blood pressure that may offer protection from preeclampsia and other conditions conditions like stroke. Wouldn't it be amazing if we can translate these findings to develop a therapeutic that protects people from stroke around the world? Melissa Alardo is an evolutionary geneticist at the University of Utah. She says the extreme diving of the henyos has changed not just their bodies, but those of everyone else on the island who are descendants of divers. Ari Daniel, NPR News.